Great. So uh, uh, we are we are moving towards the the closer side, and 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 if I I, I need to ask two questions, which are more or less similar. Uh, but just meant for different uh, profiles. So the question I, I asked them in the beginning and then we'll take them answer uh, uh, one by one. So it's like, what advice you would like to give to aspiring Scrum Master and the same question will go to aspiring Agile coaches. So let's start with, because see, there are a lot of people who are uh, going for the certification programs, attending certified Scrum Masters and all. And I believe many of them are looking for team kind of a leadership role. Some of them are coming from development background, not yet have done any team leadership. That's a one type of segment. Again, the advice will be uh, different for different people, but we are just generically picking up. And then there are uh, people who are coming from old project management background. So they have been doing project management before and they kind of got into Agile and Scrum and they are trying to take it, take it forward. So maybe you want to classify, like categorize your advice or give a similar advice or a generic advice to, to both. So if someone is aspiring to become a Scrum Master, based on your own experience and what you see in the community, what can help them? Again, excellent question, uh, Saket. To be very frank, first I'll touch base on certifications. Certifications are great. I have quite a few certifications, but uh, to be very honest, uh, certifications can only get you uh, not, not very far. Your practical experience and willingness to do the role will kind of make you successful. So first of all, if you want to be a Scrum Master, you need the willingness to be a Scrum Master. What that means, you have to be really, really team oriented. You have to uh, belong to the team and have to bring every people in the team into the senses that they are part of the team. We win as a team, we lose as a team. If we fail, it doesn't matter. As a Scrum Master, you'll be ready to protect and strengthen that feeling. Yes, failure is an opportunity to learn. We fail fast, we learn fast. So if you're being, uh, you want to be a Scrum Master, first of all, be a team man, bring that positive energy and try to channel the positive energy towards the teammate. Believe me, people are really good. People are highly skilled. That's why people are in the organization, regardless of what methods they're working on. They're being successful. That's why organization has kept them for their skill and experience. So as a Scrum Master, your job would be to bring that in a team setting because, uh, well, uh, ten, uh, a team is stronger than an individual. So if you can channel that energy positivity within the team, team will do it. And don't be afraid to let them go and uh, take their own charge of their work and fail and learn from that. That autonomy helps people to bring the most best out of them. And at the same time, you should possess uh, enough and solid uh, knowledge on Agile. That's where your certification comes in, Scrum Theory and Practices. Uh, that will uh, help you improve people's Agile way of knowledge, set up the process for Agile, uh, lead without being a formal leader, that means assert your influence that that's where your domain knowledge and expertise will come in if you're coming from developer or business analyst or business side or any side then you have to be a really effective communicator and very transparent in communication so one of the key part uh, which i haven't touched before is like you need to make sure there is no silo within the team everyone have the same information and pretty much at the same time and you let everyone's voice be a matter in the team so that's how the team develops and if the team develops as a scrum master your job is I would say 80% done because the team will do the delivery, which matters. Then your job becomes, okay, how do I make them more agile? But the, if you cannot develop the team sense, well, uh, my friend, the job's gonna be probably tough. So <laughs> one line, be a team man, develop the team. <laughs> 